He was just bluffing. There's no way Fighter Pass Volume 1 would end with a Fire Emblem character. That would be the worst outcome. I bet Marth and his clones are going to be happy flexing on everyone if that does happen. <sighs> well, here we go again. This is all your fault, Corrin! Uh, Roy, I think your return as DLC might have been the one that started controversy. Me? Me? Uh, unlike these other bozos over here, I'm the best! People loved me! They missed me! Everyone loved me! I was their boy! Name one person that actually loves this albino reptile over here. Name one! I can't take this, guys! This isn't it! Leave some for me! Be a calm away! Big brother! Be a good wife of all day! Foot jaws, my boy! Let's go! Oh my god! Roy, I think it's best not to bring his name like that. With such disrespect. Guys, guys, may I just have everyone's attention? I understand Byleth was not a very welcome character, nor a requested character, but he's part of the family. Can we at least be like decent fighters and just give him a warm welcome? I heard that there are doubles of everyone. Great! First Robin, then Corrin, and now this guy! Ugh! I swear Sakurai has fetishes for us! Uh. I wouldn't really say it like that. After all, we are getting really popular, especially after Awakening's releases and sales. My opinion? We should have ended it at Awakening. It was a good ending. A way to wrap everything up. And just like your hair, the money had to flow. Hmm. What's wrong? Are we missing someone? Hey, yeah. Hey Roy, have you seen Lucina? Hmm? Nope. Hey, there's some sort of noise going over there. Well, if that's the case, I'm heading off. Wish me luck. Hey, has anyone seen Lucina? Reach for my hand. Go, 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 go. Come on, Lucina. We're heading back to our room. Wanna go shopping? Sounds good to me. He'll be on the top floor. You know, maybe getting a vasectomy isn't a bad thing. You think? Uh-oh. Sounds like something's happening over there. It's getting pretty loud. It's coming near us. We're all gonna die! Alright everyone, I'm gonna be heading out again. Whatever you do, don't leave this room. Understand? No, no. I got it. Alright, what's going on over here? I think I came in a bad time. Ah. <sighs> well, well, well. Look who decided to show up. Okay, guys. Fun's over. Are you okay? Yeah. I got better treatment back at the monastery. You'll get used to it. Even you... Two? What? Never expected both of us to come? Well, Smash can ignore the time-space paradox. We've got Inkling, who's from 12,000 years from the future, and two Belmonts from different centuries. And not to mention, we also have many different Marios. <laughs> Uh, hey, um, what's so funny? 
Okay, so there's like two by lifts, right? So when I make it by left, get it? By, by, left, by, anyone? Bra. The only buy I understand was bye bye, you Japanese sushi munching, sword eating freaks! After them! <laughs> I thought I told you to stay behind. Look, I get it. Y'all hate us. Yeah! <laughs> oh, okay. Wow, uh, that was kind of unexpected, but... Ooh, that actually hurts. But anyways, I understand that everybody hates us. Mostly because we have the same moveset. Well, not everyone in our series has the same moveset. We use other weapons outside of swords. We use bows and lances and axes. Yeah, that's really cool and all, but we really don't care. Well, I care. STOP CARING! We all have a sword, a counter, massive waifus, and a 3000 year old lolly in every installment. We may be privileged to have 8 fighters, but we weren't always like that. It was me and Marth in the beginning. No one even knew who we were back then. We never got those precious, big, warm, soft mommy milkers. Well, now I have more things to add on why I hate Fire Emblem. Aren't you like 15? You're too young to know loot content. And are you like... A buzzkill? Cause you're interrupting my speech. Anyways, I get it. Too many swordsmen and women. We have that much. But we're kinda tired that it rubs up into our series. If we divided everyone with a sword, and have everyone whose sword is a major part of their moveset, Link, Toon Link, Meta Knight, and Cloud, for example, would have the same vibe as us. But I'm from Dirt Party, and I'm incredibly popular, so I'm basically off the hook. I have no idea what you just said. Sorry to rain on your parade, Storm Cloud, but I don't think that can work. Also, I want to ask people a couple of questions. Dr. Mario. Huh? How many fighters are from your series? Uh, let us see. There is about nine fighters. Okay, okay. Lucario. Hmm? How many fighters are from your series? Um... Do separating Pokemon Trainer count? Yes. About 10? What? What? So, everyone is fine with Super Mario and Pokemon having that many fighters, but we don't? What's up with that? We're Pokemon! It's okay when we do it! Everyone loves us! Except for Christians. Muslims! Jews! Religious figures! Oh. And that one old fart who bends spoons like it's a unique thing. Wow. I did not know you guys were strictly anti-religious. What? No, 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 no. Look, we're not anti-religious. Uh, we respect other people's religions. Even if they are wrong. Yeah, back to what I was saying. The reason I asked you all was that we... The Fire Emblem community have been growing to increase popularity now. With the help of Awakening and Fates, we've hit the Zygeist, the Apex, the Jackpot, the Cream of the Crops. Just like those two franchises, we totally deserve this. So why can't we all accept our new friend? Surely Isabel won't allow this behavior. Speaking of Isabel, where is she anyway? She went to a Disney trip on some island. Yeah, something about like a promotion to a new game. Isn't the island inhabited? Uh, yeah, uh, at least a couple people are over there. 
So, she's on a business trip. Does she even know that Byleth came? Oh, she knew before everyone else. Really? How, how do you know that? Unlike you, I still have contact. You had to bring that up today. I mean, he's right. You should have just left her alone. You just had to take her clothes off. I'm, I'm sorry, what? She was very... happy about the news. Weirdo. You know... <clears throat> what you said about Fire Emblem growing in popularity is true. You do make a fine statement. But there is one problem. Oh yeah? What would that be? Fire Emblem detected! Opinion rejected! Let's kill them! <laughs> Alright, everyone, follow me. We're heading back to retreat. Oh my, is this how everyone reacts? Man, this is why I hate Westerners. They never give us a chance. Well, there is that Pokemon Direct announcement. I really hope everyone gets excited and forgets all of this. Hey, has anyone noticed that the door isn't banging that much? Huh, I guess so. Can we leave the door now? Hmm. Let's slowly back up. I think they all left. Maybe they might trick us. Hmm. I'm going out again. Hmm. Coast is clear? No one's here. That is really odd. Anyways, welcome to Smash, Byleth. I hope you like getting ambushed. Oh, you mean like that? What the? How did you guys get up there? Mewtwo's teleport, of course. Now, gang, let's give them a welcoming gift they'll never forget. Oh, jeez. Listen up, you little radish munchers! This battle is about to become way too exciting to show our younger viewers! So, instead, I will show you this soothing image until the fight is over. Sweet! Mother of five, you should see this! Woo! It appears to be over. Let's go back to the... Whoa! That was entirely my bad! I misread the signals! I knew a guy named Joe. He misread the signals in a combat situation! Now he eats everything through a mechanical straw. Wait, battle's over. Carry on. I hate this year already. What? But it's only February. I know, it's it's just that we ended volume one with a Fire Emblem character, World War Three was nearly started, and don't you get me started on that Pokemon Direct. Ugh, I'd rather be watching that so-called 24-7 Force livestream with Galeria Ponyton than that. At least we got some new content, be grateful! That kind of mentality, especially from shilling Poketubers, Twitter fans, and Joe Merrick himself are the reason why I want to beat people to death! You're still not in the game, you know! Also, $60 for DLC? That looks like something that should have been in the post-game! Now, if anyone wants to play the full experience, you have to cough up $120, plus tax. That sounds way too much, but it's only the beginning. They'll soften now. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I'm complaining about games. It's a new year, a, a new decade, actually. We should look ahead. Uh, I mean, six new fighters for a new fighter's pass. I really hope they're better than what we've got. Excuse me? I got Joker and Terry, while you got Banjo and Kazooie. Are they not good enough for you? Well, we could see that Minecraft guy in Smash you were talking about. First of all, you uncultured balloon, the Minecraft guy's name is Steve! Yeah, 2020 doesn't sound that bad at all. What could possibly go wrong? A giant deadly global pandemic? <laughs>
At least we got Cuphead. Shut up.